Thank you so much for watching Tomoshita Music. Camera is right here. <laughs> so today I'm gonna uh, demo this amazing unit, Universal Audio Dream 65. Basically, amazing uh, Fender Classic Deluxe Reverb in the box. And this is so, so useful and I'm really enjoying. And before I make this video, uh, I was figuring out, you know, getting different tone. <clears throat> Basically, more than exactly classic uh, deluxe reverb sound and amazing. This is, has a boost, master volume, and of course a tremolo. So, so right now I'm setting tremolo, tremolo. It's a kind of or vibrato, you know. That sounds, you know. So basically, as if we were using deluxe reverb vibrato channel which is has reverb on so right now i'm setting really simple uh volume about i think noon ish right oh, i'm sorry yeah so like a two two things um okay so watch here so this one volume just like an amp right so you know setting like this uh, around three or four it's just nice um Kind of keep clean, but if you push, you, you get this. So, my guitar volume is 10, so really easy to understand. So, this is boost right now, it's not boost is on. And now, Oxford that's like original speaker, you know, 1964 65 deluxe reverb. And you can change to green back and a selection or a EV, you know, and setting right now, stock setting amp okay and then you can change to Stevie Ray Vaughan modification or 80s OD modification you can guess what it is <clears throat> and you can do the boost so this section more like you can you know adding more gain if you want to then you can change speakers and of course um, if you get the app you can change speaker cabinet and miking you know a little bit more detail <laughs> So if you have a you know studio doing session, if you want to get different type of sounds, definitely you want to get into it. But my, my <clears throat> I'm just do you know play parts and very specific ones. So I can make just like I am. I just you know right now I'm making sounds from the front. So so right now, uh, so <clears throat> whatever the setting you like, and if you press this, uh, hold it down, then you can. Um, basically right here you can store so right now so right now this is stock stock means really simple uh, <clears throat> sound right now so once again you know stock you know regular deluxe reverb sound and this knob can use as a reverb so you know if you want to set reverb a little bit less no reverb really good it cleans up really nice with volume too you know so right now 
it's a really clean sound. So the great part is you turn down this like this and raise this, you keep clean. And here, maybe a little bit more bass. Yeah. So this is bass and treble, and this is boost. So right now, we had a simple setting, maybe like this. So clean. All bass. So right now <clears throat> I'm running a uh, Yamaha powered speaker, just like studio monitor. So that's really, you know, 10, I think a 10 inch speaker. Yeah, so really tiny. And so it is really different from real guitar amp, like a 12, you know, inch speaker, but you can change cabinets and, you know. Okay, so let's do this. So this is great, you know. So the regular deluxe reverb has only volume. The problem is sometimes you want to turn like this, you know, five or six to get more gain. So with it. And turn down this a little bit. Okay. So now you see this is master volume. Now, all the way. So like really good about dynamics, you know, so like So this is only picking dynamic So if I dig in If I turn down the volume, okay, you see? So this is the great part is <clears throat> um, very sensitive with the volume, so which is like an amp. And so now, <clears throat> You can raise more, you get more overdrive, then you can turn down the overall volume, so you don't have to be afraid of a volume. Now, this guy, it boosts. I think that works. Here you go. Gets a little louder and a little rounder. You see, idea is very versatile. Now you can get a little bit like a tweed amp almost, you know, like you can turn more uh, volume and this. So like maybe I can do extreme, more like a setting like this. So still, I'm setting uh, Oxford. Uh. So this way, it's almost, you know, amp crank up. But then if you turn down the volume, so sometimes like you know intro of a song, like
raise the volume. So you got the idea. Now, so back to, you know, so here, normal, right? So now option is you can change um, amp, a little bit different type of amp, or you can change um, speaker setting. So I think interesting, maybe like <clears throat> we can try. Uh, so keep it like, you know, similar like that. I think, you know, that sounds good. And then this, uh, let's see. So this is a, um, okay, let me see. Okay. Maybe I can boost a little bit like this, just a little bit, you know. So maybe I'm playing blues like that. So now, so this is regular uh, Oxford. So now this setting, uh, selection, green back. So, you know, compared to Oxford, uh, green back and selection has a little bit more rounder top end, a little bit more pushing mids. And, you know, Deluxe River as known as um, <clears throat> very bright amp. So some people prefer change speaker. Jazzy, you know. So now you can hear a little bit of overdrive sound. So now turn down the master volume, turn up the volume. Now I'm good at it. Now looking at the control, so like this.
like I'm playing funk. So now this setting, let's try, um, you know, uh, like 80s overdrive. So if you go this one, so let's see. So this is cool about if, if you play solo. So now that's 80s, right? So now this one, um, this is Steve Ray Vaughan. Now you can change to this, you know, uh, EV. So EV, uh, like Larry Carlton, Robin Ford, a uh, Robin Ford is EV? Maybe. No. Like a lot of studio musicians used to use um, deluxe reverb and EV on studio because you know gets really good, good clean sound, but also good distortion. Nice. Then this. This is really good. Now I'm back to play clean. So if you want to play a little jazz, maybe you want to do like a boost this bass a little bit and lower a little bit, maybe like that. So now <clears throat> EV. Okay, so let's get the little clean sound. So now they're all the way down, clean. I like just have it. Almost this. As if you you have really nice tube to you know drive the amp a little bit. That's why I'm kinda of thinking, you know, this. Almost like an extra tube, you know. compare now we can compare the speakers so now oops no actually <clears throat> okay. so that's that's a Steve Ray Vaughan modification so basically means this this is a regular speaker I mean regular amp but this is somebody prefer like a Steve Ray Vaughan <clears throat> you know modification almost like you know using Five seven, what's that? Five seven two. I forgot the name of tube. So like a little bit more lower out of uh, um, preamp tube to you know drive the amp basically. So basically, this is a stock clean, good for you know rhythm and guitar. a lot of bass. So now like that and this this guy <coughs> confusing huh? this is a lot of people prefer almost like a mid boost okay so now let's, let's go back to this Oxford okay this one this Oxford Nice. So this is 
great for rhythm music. Now, this one, selection, great for solo. That's nice. So now, and this. <clears throat> now this is um, EV. It's kind of flat. Steve Ray is an EV too. But I'm so glad that, you know, uh, Universal Audio and did this. And my friend James Santiago, he did a great job making it. <laughs> is a pedal that's going down a little bit because. <laughs> okay, I think you got the idea. Um, you know. If you need more, um, if you need more detail, always go sweet water. You know, that's the best one. That's the best one. Oops. It does a great um, demo. Demo. You know, I like the guy. He's a great guitar player too. So, oh, this is too short. So now. <laughs> Three. Three thirty-five. So just you know, you know, a couple minutes. So yeah, just make sure we have this. Um, just yeah, I want to make sure what we have. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. So now that's the stock. <laughs> Let's, let's push with a uh, preamp. Alright, so now, uh, let's see. Maybe I can do this. Um, Steve Ray Vaughan modification, a little lower. And so this is uh, Oxford. <laughs> change to this. Selection Greenback. Okay, so now this is um endo is this one so this is um ev all right and then turn this a little bit turn down that and turn up this so you oops i changed so this way steve ray Vaughan. maybe a little too much Or you can do 
stock. You know, breaks up. Like that. And then, 80s. So many ways you can do it. It's a, uh, too many choices because three different amp settings, three different speaker settings. So this is Stevie Ray. Like breaks up moments now. Okay, let's go back to normal. So this is normal. This is normal and clean and bring up. So back to this, you know, no, normal sound, really nice. You get the idea, all right? Thank you so much for watching Thomas the Music. This is Universal Audio Dream 65, <clears throat> just like all the vintage Fender Deluxe Reverb. Thank you, and if you like my channel, please subscribe my channel and don't forget the notification button. You will hear more. And if you like to learn more guitar, of course, please join Guitar Wisdom. We have a three days free trial now. All right, see you soon. Thank you so much.